dumb but is here to entertain you. It is one thing to get into a relationship. It is another to actually get married. It is very easy after getting married to have problems and becomes very difficult to solve these problems without it dashing out to the public eye and have a public opinion, especially when you are a media personality or a top celebrity. In today's video, Vusi Tembekwayo may have to pay his wife Palesa Maketa 110,000 rands per month for maintenance after she filed for divorce already because of all the bad things that he did to her. We are about to give you all some detailed information and very sensitive one as at that. So do well to watch this video because things are going so south for Vusi right now and he's about to even go so bankrupt. Will he be able to actually maintain the standard? Do well to watch the video to get all the information. Before I give you the information properly, welcome to this channel. Kindly subscribe to this YouTube channel, like this video, drop a comment after watching the entire video and hit on to my post notification bell. Vusi Tembequayo's wife, Palesa Maketa, has filed for divorce. It is clear that the news just keeps on coming in South Africa and our celebrities will never surprise us in what they can really do. It is very concerning for the general public to even find out that there is such a situation that Vusi Tembequayo and his wife are going through and many people are seriously concerned about something like this even exists. Apart from the GBV allegations, Palesa has actually accused Vusi of cheating on her with a woman he traveled frequently with. So obviously, he's in a very tough situation and he has to pay such an exorbitant amount of money to individuals that he's related to. What I really feel so sad for right now is the fact that he has always been painting a very sent image out there. He has been proven to us that he really can't even hurt a fly and now the wife has actually unboxed the whole thing and she has revealed all his nasty characters to the public. She wants a divorce and he is bound to pay 110,000 rands every month. We understand that perhaps it will actually be very easy for him to pay this money because if his uh, family members come in, of course, he will actually be able to do so. But it is going to be so difficult because the amount is so large if he's supposed to take this on his own and he might as well even go bankrupt and face a lot of tough times if and only if assistance is not given to him. It is alleged that you don't necessarily have to be a woman to benefit from this rule. You just have to be married and earning a lot less than your spouse to such an extent where you will be liable for payment for your upkeep. I don't know if this has anything to do with the fact that the person will be taking care of you, but either way, it is quite interesting that something like this is even possible. Palesa seeks 50,000 rands a month in rehabilitative maintenance and 20,000 rands for each of the three children. This is very interesting that the family of this businessman will be liable for such payments. They are going to find themselves in a situation where they are getting this money per month and this could also be forever, meaning that the husband is paying the sum of money until perhaps the court decide otherwise, but there are chances that will never happen. I personally feel so sad for him right now and that's why I always tell people that do not always judge other people. Do not see the kind of things that people leave, they show on social media and you think that they are the most perfect people. You can be a very nice person but the one time that your nasty character is being exposed to the public, you become the worst person on earth in the eyes of the public. Vusi has actually shown us several times that he is a good person, nice person, so kind and so loving to be with but now his wife has decided to fire so hard on him. Never cheat again. All men there, don't cheat. Women, stop cheating on your husbands as well. Tell me what you think in the comment section.